I love this man. <laughs> no. No, it doesn't. It really doesn't. <laughs> the music is really good. It doesn't save the damn thing. <laughs> Well, I might as well go to my type advantage, I guess. What's the paling? No, not my non existent. Actually, to be fair, their attack stats actually kind of existent. Because, uh,. They do still suffer from even stat syndrome. That's the only frozen I'm going to get this entire playthrough, probably. You know, I'm going to be a dick and just use spikes. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> or to let the hail kill it. Not bad. Not great. Yeah, it's going to take a little bit. Uh, typically with Twitch and stuff, uh, it, you have to wait... You usually have to wait a month, because they'll do the call every month or so. Like, basically, they'll, they'll round it every month. So it'll take a little bit, but it won't take too long. Zappy. Yeah, it, it takes a little bit. Not too long. I guess it's, to be fair, the big reason is probably because it's to make sure that you uh, are, like, keeping it. Because you could hypothetically lose all those followers, like, lose a follower or something. In the meantime... I hate him. Oh no, fire spin. What will I ever do? I'm like the more take more damage from it. Yeah, I take more damage from like the, the fire spin like after the fire spin.
Ow. If I have time, I may do something Christmassy. Not Christmassy, but like for the holidays. That involves like something going long. We shall see. It's clearly it's extra shooting scrambled. <laughs> I don't have extra shooting. Or extra shooting scrambled. I have I don't have either. No, I already have stuff for people to share. I'm not going to. Uh, I'm not going to put my account on more. Of, like I'm going to let, not going to let more people on my account. Slash on my PC about that. So go. Besides, it wouldn't be that anyway. An idea. It's stupid. I don't know if it'll if I'll do it or not. We'll see because it'll be it should be something inter interesting later on anyway. Just don't worry, we're just catching emergency pit bulls. Remember everyone, Surf works on hippos. I also apologize for the shitty visibility. It's better that it was in Gen 1, it's like... in actual... Diamond and Pearl though. DM100, Rock Climb. Why is it just sitting there? Because someone dropped it. God damn it, I keep forgetting, like... Gen 1 Sinnoh? What? 
<laughs> what is that monstrosity? That just sounds like a broke mess. Oh yeah, it's a Gen 1 before Gen 4. Eh, it's fine. Flash cannon. Mm. It could be cool if it wasn't a buggy mess. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it was that way. Okay. I found the Icy Rock. Nah, they're not that bad. There are routes like that with the uh, with the ninja, with the ninja kids. They're not really invisible, but they're hard. They can be hard to spot. day after this because we're gonna be we're gonna be doing Team Galactic after this. For low visibility to GP. Um, they'd probably just make it so, like, you'd have, it'd be like Flash, you'd have very limited space. But like, like, instead of, say, having, you walk into a room and it's shrinking, it just, when you step into a specific route, it shrinks. And maybe, like, give every so often, like, say when it calms, like, it give you bigger space. You could do it. Though more likely you would just leave that route alone and not do it. Just to avoid the hassle. Time for the best, Jim. That I could cheese, because hypothetically... They forgot you could go out of diagonal. I, I don't want to cheese, though, so.
I have to fight you. I don't have to fight you? I do have to fight you, though. Okay. For this gym, not gonna lie. <laughs> Even in platinum, this gym is just kind of sad. It's the issue of putting ice at seven. That, that, that fire, said with ice too. The thing is, there's also very few water, like for G for G generation anyway. There's pretty few water types as well. Die, please. Hmm. Interesting. So, Bell. Pretty much. The problem was they also didn't put many... Like, the dex itself is small. Because at least in, like, for example, in Johto, they had quite a few of the Kanto mods to pull from. Like, I think the Johto dex is 200, I think, or something? So it's like, it's reasonably big. Yeah, Gen 3 did a pretty damn good job, actually. Uh, at least how I remember it. Uh, no, we yeah, we want to run into you. There's reason we want to run into them. I remember the specifics. Yeah. Yeah, because Gen 3. Oh, I didn't realize it was Centric Um.
yeah, behind, like, it had a bunch of new added mons, and then it also had a bunch of mons from the previous games also in it. Which were convenient. This is the side we wanted. Because we already had that. Um, oh yeah, we just want to we just want to go this way. <laughs> My brain can't function. Plenty of good parts about Gen 3. Fuck you. <laughs> Even if you don't like the game, like, games just pacing-wise, there's plenty of good things. <laughs> Including mechanical additions. <laughs> Ah yes, Steelix. You know, the thing that screams ice type. It screams it, you know? I understand why Empoleon is, like, water steel, but water ice would have been very neat and would have given... The ice gym, you know, an ace. That would be interesting. Just saying. I just realized, I just, I forgot just how stupid I was like, this set is. It literally is going to be stealth rock set up. That spikes, and that would have probably, I would maybe see if I can get toxic. I don't think I can toxic spikes. Like, it's going to be brutal. Especially if I can set up all the layers of spikes. I think spikes get two layers, I think. But I can't. Wait, I'm an idiot. <laughs> I have more meant abilities. Come on. Not double battles. 
<laughs> so yes, spell bottles were added, and in Emerald, they actually made them far more common and required. <laughs> like, yeah, abilities, increased move pool, adjustment of bugs. <laughs> Die, Snover, please. It had a bigger impact mechanically, but Gen 3 also had it because it brought over new engine. There's a lot of little things. This may be a dumb idea, but I'm doing it anyway. See the numbers go down. <laughs> it just dropped you straight to zero. <laughs> this is, by the way, why you don't fuck with Avalanche. <laughs> huh? I was hoping that would kill. I got pretty close, but. I just didn't want Houndoom getting hit by Dig. I don't mind me, I'm just casually going to kill him at a champ. charge on you is garbage. It has the berry that resists fire. I could still try it. But I believe it has that berry which resists fire. I think. So it's going to cut my damage in half. I still killed it. Okay, no, it didn't happen there. I thought it did. I'll have to look at her team to see what she has, then. Yes, I know they're filthy. Fading requires extra mode. Um. Uh... No, it has a citrus berry. Okay. Holy shit, it has Aurora Veil. I did not know that. I am glad I was able to set that up so you couldn't use Aurora Veil. The M72s! It's Avalanche. 
which actually wouldn't be bad to put on. Um, Frostlass, but since my Frostlass is more physically inclined than actually inclined. Yeah. I thought they put the, uh, that berry on them, but I guess, I guess they're not, uh, worthy to get those berries yet. Hey, Team Galactic. We're gonna beat you up soon. Was debating using Sneasel, but doubling on Dark is... wasn't the best idea. And I couldn't get Meg Mortar or anything, so. It probably wouldn't have mattered, but it could have. I like how Jupiter just says, nah, you're shit. Fuck off. Which is funny, because Barry's one of the few, like, rivals with a competitive, like, a competitive-ass team that's absolutely terrifying. Like, he's stacked, if memory serves, at the end of the game. Like, he, he's just... Stacked. Yeah, in this case, I turned Piplup. He'd have Staraptor, Floatzel, Heracross, Rapidash, Snorlax, and Dorterra. He's stacked. Uh, I believe when you have Chim, I forget which which team is more terrifying. Uh, definitely, he, if you chose Turtwig, his team's most terrifying, because he doesn't have that Rapidash, he has the Infernape instead. Oh, it's Floatzel Spooky. Like, that Floatzel's absolutely spooky. It's not it's crazy spooky. It's, it, it is the spook. Look at the fifth. Um, his fifth team, because that's probably the more accurate one. Thanks for the storage key. Come on, doggo. Duskstone. <laughs> I went through the five years I've gotten. Yeah, it is bloody terrifying. <laughs> he loses the Rapidash, which makes sense. And, oh my lord, he's terrifying. Which is, like, it's so weird. You wouldn't think his, like, team would be so good. No, nope, it's really good. Yeah. 
the, the, the rapid edge, the, the, like, it, it's just not that scary. Everything else is terrifying. He has just sweep and then that Snorlax in the back. Ooh, a bottle of zinc. That's special defense, yeah. What he forgot to read, what they were sending out. I believe once you get to the weekend battles, it's like that. No, is it not? Or is it? No, okay, no, they just never have items. That That is a little odd. Yeah, that is a little odd. Odd indeed. They probably just didn't want to make it too brokenly powerful. Flamethrower. I will see about trying to beat this game tonight, just because, like, maybe I'll we'll actually fucking finish. Uh, because we're at a point which is, like, reasonable like actually beat the game it's just cynthia be spook yeah i guess boosted mega horn is just holy shit that's terrifying The, the grunts look in this game. Gold is good. Not necessarily better than Surf, but it's good. I may put it on someone. If they can learn it. Because that burn is...
no. You have a level 30. How the hell do you even get a whirlpool to level 32? How? Let's make sure that's dust stock. To be fair, dust stock is reasonable. It's not very good, but it's reasonable. Like, it's reasonable to have a dust stock, yeah? It's reasonable. Oh, wait, does this mean they have a level 34, like, Cascoon? Please tell me they don't have a level 34 Cascoon. If this is level 34, if this is level 34, I didn't check this beforehand. I'm psychic. Level 34. I did bite instead of flavor. And I almost killed it. From bite. I'm just gonna use bite again. Memory surge is supposed to go out there. Where does this take me? With the level skill, the crystal, crystal legacy, which is E4. All right. I'm not. You can't make me play crystal. <laughs> I've tried to play crystal ROM hacks. They're a lot of them are fucking impressive. Like a lot of them, they're very impressive from a mechanical standpoint. How the hell did they do these things on a game? That barely ran on its own GB, like on the own, like on, on its own console, is uh, in, in, like very impressive. Very much doubt though I'll play any crystal ROM again. Like I even have copy of I have I even have crystal on on VC, and I basically will never touch it. Yeah, I have no reason to play Chinchy Crystal. <laughs> like I might go back to Gen One at this point. Brilliant diamond. My birthday was last month. You way to get viewers. <laughs> now, if I if I was doing my birthday, I'd probably do B day rather than BD. 
Though that is sneaky. I like it. <laughs> yeah, probably good to go to sleep <laughs> if you were to be up in seven hours. next few weeks every Wednesday. <laughs> Hi, I shall enjoy the stream. Have a good sleep. Trying to remember Cyrus's team. It's not that spooky yet. Even then, his second team isn't that spooky either. It's his third team, and uh, it flat that spook. Phil Tennessee. Uh, she'll keep enjoying more drink. Maybe I should make a, a one shot where Players start in a town called Spookville. And you need to spook stuff. Why would you use Quick Guard? Like, I guess on a Golbat it kind of makes sense to have it. Because, like, it probably goes first, so you're assuming someone might need priority, but, like... Nah. Nah, like, it won't be... Like, it'll, it'll be less... Easy than Pit of Torment. Like specifically, it'll it'll be more kind of chill. Let's do Pit of Torment. I wouldn't name it Spookville, and you know it. Got him spooks. I forget the little. This is just the item. An extra five is very sweet.
there was an item here. There was not. Sleepy times. You see, it's just a useless room. and Kroger. Oh no, sucker punch. You're not even the one getting the most experience in <laughs> love. Uh... Oh, and by the way, if anyone run wondering, this game's EXP, you think, oh, that's a bit obscene. Um, it's actually pretty damn close to what you what you had in Diamond of Pearl. <laughs> Diamond of Pearl was pretty was pretty levelly broken as well. <laughs> Almost always in your favor until the end of the game. <laughs> that it was just high. You you no, no, like, like, Diamond and Pearl, like, when you first, like, is also like this. Like, it's not new. Nope. Yeah, it's just, it is hilarious just how, how stupidly overleveled you get in Diamond and Pearl. Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl. It is such a false sense of security. And Platinum, it's a bit better. It's a false sense of security before you face the Elite Four. Because the Elite Four, they, they lowered Cynthia's levels, but they adjusted the Elite Four's levels to be closer to hers. So it's like, it's a complete false sense of security. Hi, Cyrus. The best remix in this game. Too bad, this game has a lot of really good remixes.
A super potion. A super potion. We both did a whoops. Yeah. Cynthia be spook. No matter what game you fight her in, she's always spook. Her hardest team is probably black and white, the original, just because she has that damn Electros. But, and, and Spiritomb. But, really, in every game she's in, she's terrifying. Tiny parts of platinum they put in. Yeah, like, it, even compared to Red, she's fucking terrifying. Red has the one problem of all of his mons being right forward. Like, yeah, they're tough, but they're straightforward. Her team is not straightforward. <laughs> Why do you have rain dance? There has to be. Oh, I know why he has rain dance. It's not for damn Bronzor. <laughs> it's for, um. Best way to deal with this would probably be Lola. Hope Bracia lives. No, it's it's his uh, Toxic Rogue has dry skin. So infinite healing. Yeah, I was bound to get a hit myself. I bullshitted him doing super potion, but I didn't buy any super potions. Like they're they're trying to make something work. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if it is on Bronzor. But. Saturn. 
Nope. No, it's not just on Cadaver. Ah, Cadaver has a damp rock, actually. But yeah, it's just kind of... Kinesis reflects Psychic and Rain Dance. Probably just... I guess the idea is, is like, he's meant to use Kadabra first, so he just sets it up immediately. And I guess it kind of works for Bronzor, because Bronzor then takes half damage from fire moves. So like, it kind of works. Silly, yes. Does it work? Kinda, yeah. Still very weird, yeah. to go back into Mount Coronet. Fastest way would be hard home, I think. Wait, did I never... Not you. Let's actually go to the cathedral real quick. Gives you EV later. Oh, wait, I wanted to pick up repels. Because I don't want to deal with the wild mons. Am I prepping stuff now? Yes. Is having the amulet coin on one of my mods that I use first, typically, like, typically use first, really, really effective at getting me stuff? Yes. turned into a chimera now, once a day. However, it's semi-wild magic properties, so 20, on a roller 20, something happens. Alright, cool. That's interesting and a unique way to make druid different. So that's really strong, though. 
Like, chimeras are really strong, so... Not actually a bad idea. Will you say no to turning into the equivalent of, like, a really powerful monster? Fuck no. That kinda makes sense. I did not push that far down, I literally gently tapped down. Apparently, I can't tap down. Okay, that that's annoying. I found a problem. There we go. Uh, Willing had a scientist to make chimeric creatures do an experiment with character's core. Alright, cool. And now they have unstable magic, but they can turn them into a chimera. Which makes sense, I guess, from a like magical tampering perspective. You're messing with magic. So, magic messes back. Level 40, beautiful That's fine. Makes sense. Has to come from somewhere.
Yeah. Like, it makes sense. Personally, probably wouldn't give Druid even more powerful tactics than they already have. But okay! Because it is limited, and it does have a downside of having these surges. Which, if they don't use a traditional mild magic table, could get pretty whack pretty fast. Dogger likes being pet. That very buff that could later be given to other PCs, abilities. Oh, yeah, okay. Which, yeah, it makes sense. If you're going to buff one character, might as well make the other character stronger, even if not necessarily at the same time. You want to make sure the characters, you know, are interested. Players are interested, not the characters are interested. The characters need to be interested, but the, the players need to be interested. I feel bad for Team Galactic, because Gardevoir just kind of weeps. <laughs> Plus my attack damage is uh, within five feet for some someone for the assassin. The ability to an advantage on save and ability checks one day for an hour. Plus two on stealth for the sniper. And his ally combat plus one. There you go. Yeah. Like fish reasonable. Like, I've given some some stuff of that, but I, I typically go with mechanically changing things. Like, for example, give you the owlbear crap. I uh, like getting bear crap, rather than, uh... Rather than just modifiers.
Huh. I still need to fit. I don't know. Though, though the uh, that character's done. Actually, I need to make minis. Actually. Make two minis. Characters are important than me minis. Or at least images of them. Yeah, for D and D, yeah. My game. I have some, I have some uh, characters that not necessarily are, like, they're, they're important enough to have, uh, have, uh, have their own, uh, mini. Nah, just because I haven't made, I didn't make these characters before, so... I need to make a few others, too. I actually need to make... I need to finish some of the, uh... Some of the cases, actually. I have most of them done, and one of them is, like, really long and could potentially go on for a while. So we'll see about that one. Yeah. My game's like that. It's just, if you decide not to do something, enjoy the consequences. Thankfully, you guys have... Like, thankfully and not thankfully, uh, you've got chosen to just do fucking everything I've thrown at you. Rather than go, you know, this is not important. Let's not follow this up. Like, I was half expecting someone to just not care. And then just go, nah, this, this thing is, is here. That red thing right there, not important. We're not going to bother following that up. <laughs> Which is fine. Like, it's perfectly fine to not. Just like, kind of, like, it's kind of nice to actually have care people who fucking care. But once you finish, so to be fair, you have, you're at the halfway point now. So I'm going to be upfront with that. You're halfway through. <laughs> yeah, like, <laughs> yeah, that's probably good. I was actually expecting you to just go, like, right away. That's what I was expecting. But I will take the route you took quite well. <laughs> There's always going to be sus shit. Just you need to figure out what sus shit you want to deal with first. You know, I'm going to give her a takedown. We can have Moonblast as an option. It's more accurate and is a bit stronger, but it uses special attack instead. And 
dead. I like how instead of Cyrus, it's just boss. I just realized in canon, this is the second time this has happened to Niagara Palkia. Well, they are pretty pissed. Just they don't have the, the control to be pissed. Like, they legally, like, from what I can understand, they literally do not have the power to be pissed. <laughs> I hate that their AI is actually smart. <laughs> They're just about to use a confuse ray. <laughs> Critical hit. That's what bite is. It's nom. You know what? Fuck it. I know they're gonna get hit with dig, but.
I wished his Munchlax to die. Which is, by the way, the reason why I even sent, sent them out in the first place. I am literally going to kill their Munchlax. Oh my lord, that did nothing! This fight is so much harder than Cyrus. Because <laughs> you have to just deal with... Because you have to deal with having this much lag. It just can't do damage. Like, it does damage. It just doesn't do nearly enough. Thank you. Holy shit, that took a while. Ow. Why didn't you just start with that? Actually, well, I understand why I didn't start with it, but... Ugh. Alright, sure. That would have been useful a while ago. Lovely. Who are you bringing out? The Dweezel will probably kill the Skun Tank. Back to Golbat. <laughs> I'm gonna just discharge. This weasel just gonna die. Oh my lord! <laughs> you should have done that first! Uh, Metal Sound is not useful in Jackster. Not bad, actually, but it's not useful. If they were faster, it'd actually be useful. Everyone dies. Everyone dies. Three little shits. The 
decide to fucking stay up. Brit, your pain. Punch crow. That's one spicy special attack stat. I'm not confident that they can outspeed. I am now confident that nothing can outspeed. <laughs> A crowbat with double speed? for the high roll. Extra Potion is not going to help you. I forget, is Crobat his ace? Or is it Weavile? Either one could be his ace. I just don't know which one's which. Might as well just stick with it. <laughs> no, it's definitely Weavile. Like level 47, 48 Weavile, probably. I am glad I have Sturdy. I didn't need it. There we go. Got a recent audio. Uh, quite possible that you lose, thank you. Give it a counter. All play makes sense, actually.
Hello, good sir. I forgot to save, but it's fine. I love this battle sequence. Oh, just starting with the big gun. bit at a time. Doesn't mean you need to be stupidly low. It needs to be low enough. I believe discharge has lower power than I have no reason to actually catch Dialga. Like, I could just kill him. But... Oh, sweet. One wobble. Dragon type hyper beam go burn. I was waiting to see him with the great ball stroke back. If I'm on my last mod, I'll just use uh I'll just use the master ball Yeah, I would need a grass move if I really, really wanted to not, like, if I wanted to, like, super, supremely, like, just whittle down a teeny tiny bit at a time. Because that, that's his four times res. Yeah, not so nice. Dag with Omni Boost to spook.
He's not that hard of a catch. I think he's 40 out of 100, like 40 out of 255, so he's not actually that bad. He's a bit worse than Palkia, though, because he has more hit points. <laughs> Just by a little bit, I believe. Get in the damn ball. I wouldn't mind Will O Wisp, but That's kind of fuck with the. I need to pick up the Admiral Orb. There we go. I wanted to try and catch it with just balls I had lying around, but... Once we get Sunny Shore, we can get National Dex if I really feel like it. But. I don't. <laughs> Okay. Well, that's... Okay, I guess, actually.
I believe I have natural gear. So after the battle is done, I should I should no longer have the status. If I do, well, I do. Okay, then I'll I'll just. Serves Dark Pulse is in the is in Victory Road. This is gonna hurt. Not enough though. Okay, good. Okay. Police officer Thomas. Okay. But well, I'm using special moves. Most my deep is special. I can actually fight you fast with a uh well, it doesn't know any TM moves, which it shouldn't. Or it could just faint.
Gastron's gonna be a problem. So, so quack, sorry, but. Uh... I could probably take off Confuse Ray and put on like a grass move just for Quagsire and, and Gastrodon, but don't think it'll be needed. They're dead. There we go. Okay. Ah, uh, yes, the Emo Electric Gym. That's Gym. Probably the best way to do this is just. On Combine Span Gardevoir, probably. The goal, Pokemon League.
Okay. Yeah, right. All right. Okay, patch reason. Reasonable, reasonable. That's your reason knowing dig is a bit whack, not gonna lie. Like, it makes some sense, but... Nah, not really. Because, <laughs> like, an earthquake, that's just gonna kill it faster. <laughs> This round here. Forest, Mr. Mime. I get flashbacked whenever I see Mr. Mime to, uh... Uh, Mr. Mime in the original Pokemon Ranger games. Holy sh... The original Pokemon Ranger game, the, the first one. It is annoying. It also, I think, shows up in... I don't think in Guardian Sides, it's Shadow of the Mia that shows up in. Where it's also annoying, but it's way less annoying. That might be Guardian Signs. Not sure. But I do know that it's less annoying than the version that shows up in, in Ranger. That was just so infuriating. Oh, look, it's an electric type. I always feel so bad when I fight Luxio and Luxray, or even use them because it's just like, oh, they're good. They are good, but they're not great, and it feels like they should be great. But they aren't. Yeah, they're just okay. It's so odd. Especially since electric types, most of the time, have really, really good contenders. Like, Raichu, from a perspective, is just better than them, but that's because they specialize more. Their defenses are awful, though. Like, most electric types are just better. Not all of them, some are pretty shite. Do you have anything other than a Pikachu? You just have four Pikachu. Is this four Pikachus? 
Is this four fucking Pikachus? Please tell me this is not four Pikachus. Oh my lord, it's four fucking Pikachus. <laughs> They're all level 41. <laughs> Why? And anyone who goes, oh, by giving them the dark typing, that'll fix them. No, no, it won't. The problem is their stats, not their type. If they were either a mixed attacker or really just they need slightly higher speed. I believe that's what's really holding them back. They, they really should be a mixed attacker, but I believe they are actually a mixed attacker. Kind of. Like, sure, it's whack. Like, it, they're better physical attack. By far. But I believe it's, uh, they're. Yeah, they're not bad on special. They're just slow. They're slow for electric. It's the same problem as Vicavolt. Where it's like, they're good by attack stat wise, but they're slow. <laughs> yeah. And 95 is still pretty damn sweet. Yeah, 70 speed. As a note, that's Decidui. <laughs> that's the same speed as Decidui. <laughs> It's, uh, not very good. Yeah, it's like, it's kind of, they kind of wanted them to be, like, I guess, a bulky electric type. Like, uh, similar to Vic, like how Vicvolt is. Vicvolt's a bulky electric type. But the problem with, Vic, the thing with Vicvolt is they went full bore on it. It's slow as shit. <laughs> I believe it has a speed of, I think, I think Vicvolt, anyway, has a speed of, like, 60 or 50 some of that like yeah it's like they tried to make it something it just didn't really work i'd say drop its defenses um i, I would say probably drop its defenses increase its increase its speed or hell drop its attack by 10 and increase its speed by 10 because like that, that'd be fine or if you want to go more physical attack, drop its special attack by 10. Which would make it more physical attack and then up its speed by 10. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Vicavolt's really slow. But it embraces the slow. That's the difference. It embraces the slow. You want to embrace the slow. If you're stupid slow, you have there's stuff you can do with it. If you're in that weird category of like, I'm kind of fast, like I can outspeed some things, but I can't necessarily outspeed everything, then you're in that weird category. And I don't know how to help you. It's a it's very much better than Chrome because it's not stuck with a really shit typing. Bug Electric is actually really good because it gets rid of one of the electric's weaknesses. Like, yeah, you get fire in exchange, which is also a common type, but so uh, there's other, like, other issues with it. But it, it's not stuck with electric uh, ice. Ice fighting is like the best offensive type combination 
but one of the worst defensive combinations. <laughs> you can murder fucking everything with it, on like an offensive standpoint. Like you cannot take anything. <laughs> We just do this again. Go here. Turn that around once. Head on up. What's with these Steelixes and having damn sturdy? None of the damn Steelixes in the Rock Gym had sturdy. The Steel Gym. Rock Gym 2.0. <laughs> That's nothing though. Level 50. Meta Cham. Okay, okay, okay. It is fast. Oh wait, yeah, I remember now. Then a halfway. There you go. And Volkner. The edgy emo boy himself. I do like his jacket, though. So, here's how I'm going to do this. Hear me out. Very simple strategy. It's called... I hit Calm Mind. Then we go smack. Okay, I would go smack. Okay, they're faster. Baha! I can have a great special defense, you fool. Eh. Also just realized he's just in the blade unlimited blade works. Like come on, there's all gears everywhere and everything. No. Definitely not.
Well, kind of, actually, because, you know, action surge. Jordan would like to be petted. Got it. You fool. But you've just condemned your last mod to death. You've condemned this luxury to death. This luxury is going to die. Yeah, he, uh. Yeah. He, he didn't sleep. So he has none of the benefits of a long rest. And. It, no, your trump card was luxury. Um, uh, and so he has that point of exhaustion. Uh, yeah. I doubt anything bad will happen. Probably. Maybe. Oh shit, wait, he's the cleric. <laughs> He'll, he'll be fine. Stretch. We'll see what happens. I like the cute little dress that Jasmine wears. Give me 99. Waterfall. Oh, that was quick. Like, level, yeah, but I, we don't fuck up. If everyone dies, then uh, everyone's dead. We don't have resurrection yet, do we? Uh, do, do, uh, it's not resurrection. Um, yeah, we don't have. Ray's dad yet, do we? <laughs> that's the kind of shit version of Resurrection. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Hmm. Well, here's hoping, uh, if anyone dies, we, uh, don't need them.
Uh, I think six. Because I know I gave people a level up, but I believe that was six. Seven. I don't. Yeah, because I don't think Aaron Frost is seven. So I think Aaron Frost is. Uh, Poor man, Tyke. This poor, poor man, Tyke. He didn't deserve this. Yeah. Uh, I don't. Uh, the courtier feature, I think, is later. Yeah, Courtier is seven. Yeah. Look, they may be stacked in charisma, but that doesn't necessarily mean that they're immediately going to be great at per uh, persuasion. Ignore the fact that they already have efficiency persuasion. <laughs> ah, heal pulse, the worst move. To be fair, they I like they have more. Um they have they have more like ability score improvements than anybody else, so they totally could. Or, like, I could go in Intimidation or something. Um. Yeah, this isn't good for the Houndoom. I'm a just... Yeah, just be better sword fog. Like, or, like, come on, like, don't worry about it. To be fair, that's kind of what Samurai kind of is. They're, they're better Valor Bard, basically. Uh, not better Valor Bard. Um, sword Bard. And they are kind of built that way, because they're Dex Fighter. But the thing is, their level 3 features, like, gales and crap, so makes them pretty decent. Why Swords Bard is one of the bards a lot of people recommend playing. Because it just makes you, you have utility and you can fight on your own. Which is the one problem of basically uh, all of the... Like all the bards have. They can't really fight on their own. <laughs> Swords Bard, uh, Valor Bard can also fight on their own, but even then, they don't. They're not great at it. <laughs> they're more. I get close to the enemy and I can stab them, but I'm more meant to kind of boost my friends around me. Aw, oh, sweet, I can do Thunder Strikes. Bladesinger exists, which is hilarious, and I love how a wizard subclass is better at doing sword, like, bard's job than, uh, <laughs> than bard is. Oh, 
Now, Blade Singer has its own issues, including but not limited to it really only being good in certain cases. I don't want to fight you. Well, we're going to go very slightly the other way. And we can avoid a fight. I have to fight you. <laughs> Better half caster than half caster. <laughs> Get a cake with their with their dinner without coming. Yeah, true. You can have you can have your cake and eat it too. In specific cases. Okay, I'm going to take a quick stretch break. <laughs> so, because I've been sitting down for a while, uh, I go to the bathroom and stuff, and then we will tackle the Elite Four and crap. I'm going to do... That. Yeah. There you go.